Hi everyone! I am back for another coffee tutorial thing. Uh, just kind of making something I enjoy. Um, I'm going to make a either cake batter latte or strawberry shortcake. I haven't quite decided yet. I think I'm gonna go with strawberry shortcake because that's really good. Um, so let me get my strawberry out too. Everything else I have out. Um, got my mug. Let's not break things. I've got some brown sugar. Got the cake batter extract and vanilla extract. Um, and then the strawberry and milk. Um, I always use non-dairy milk because my tummy is sensitive and it just handles it better. Um, so, oh, I forgot my espresso. That would be helpful. So we will start by, let's see. I don't really have a measurement for how much brown sugar I use. I usually just pour some in, but for sanitary purposes today and for a video, I'm going to do two scoops, I guess. See if that looks right. Two cats at my feet. Okay, which I guess looks like a lot, but um, it goes down. I'll show you in a second. Um, so daylight saving time just happened on Sunday. It is currently Tuesday, and my body is not handling well. So yeah, I had some brown sugar. And then there's like a splash of vanilla. I have like the fake vanilla that was super cheap. Um, so you need a little bit more. But if you have the real vanilla extract, please use that. Probably tastes a lot better than this. So yeah, you just add a little bit of that. And then Again, I got this at BB's. It was only 60 cents. I've loved it. it smells amazing. Mm. Kind of smells like a cupcake. So yeah, you just kind of add a little bit of that. And do a little extra today. And then, since it is strawberry shortcake or cheesecake, whatever you want to call it, we also need to add some strawberry syrup. Not too much because this particular strawberry is um, very strong, very potent. It kind of tastes, smells medicinal. Um, and I kind of go by smell, which is really dumb. But once it smells right, which obviously you can't do in like a professional setting, but if it, you're just making a latte at home, why not? Okay, that smells better. Um, and I did get comments last time asking like what kind of brands I like. Um, I usually just use whatever's readily available. <laughs> um, again, I got this from BB's. It was $1.75 and it's the Jamaican choice. Um, but I use a lot of extracts. I also have this cherry syrup from Grace. That I also got at BB's. Uh, BB's is legit like my favorite place to get just random crap that you may not might not be able to find other places. All right, so I'm going to add a little water in my machine. Add three scoops. It doesn't have to be perfect. And like I did last time, um, just gonna turn it on, flip the cup thingy down, 
um oh, can't forget this guy and then flip the drip stop and hit specialty which is four ounces yeah um i kind of accidentally discovered this latte a few months ago i can't remember if i got the cake batter stuff first or oh this is gonna be really loud i'm so sorry I can't remember if I got cake batter first or the strawberry, but um, uh, oh, oops, I dropped something back there. Um, but either way, it was pretty good. Um, I've kind of been tweaking it ever since. Um, like I said, I really like to experiment with different flavors and combinations. I um, mean, you get a better view of my kitchen today. Got it's kind of messy, but I'm kind of also covering the messiest parts. But that's okay. This is real life. <laughs> um, I poured my milk into my Nespresso steamer. I guess I'm just gonna put it away. What's really nice about my kitchen is that everything is pretty close together. It's not always ideal, not for every situation, but, um, oh, look at that belly. Why are you staring at me? My kitty is on her back with her belly in the air. Belly in her paws. She's so cute. Um, but yeah, I mean, it's a small kitchen, but for little videos like this it works. I don't know if you can hear me. So I'm just gonna be quiet. Easy way. Well that's a boring. I'm still in my PJs today. We um, had somebody picking something up at like 7, 7.15. And since time change just happened, it was a little difficult for me to get out of bed. Um, thankfully, they just needed to me to open the door, hand them the thing, and uh, leave. So hopefully there was no room for judgment. <laughs> still in my PJs. Like I said, this is real life. Um, the espresso is almost done, so I'm gonna go ahead and push the espresso button. Like I said, it's almost done. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and stir this. The spoon I use for brown sugar because why would I get another one? I don't really have anything super fun and yummy to top this with like I did with the chocolate syrup in the last video but if I had like non-dairy whipped cream and like sprinkles I would do that because that would be super yummy or like whipped cream and strawberry drizzle not syrup drizzle well the strawberry syrup that Hershey's makes that one would be good for like a drizzle but the strawberry syrup that I just used would not be but yeah, like whipped cream and like maybe some strawberry chunks or like cheesecake chunks, that would be really good. Um, now I just wait for the milk. This is the awkward part, I'm just waiting. Um, I didn't get too many comments on suggestions on what to make this time around um so I kind of just went with something familiar to me oh geez I think I got myself too much milk nope we're good I'm gonna stir it up one more time and There it is. 
I'm using, here we go. I'm trying to get a good pic, like, shot of it, but on my phone is a little bit difficult. Here we go. Um, I hope that worked. But yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and cut the video there. I know this is gonna taste fine, so I'm not gonna taste it on camera. Oop, we're not gonna show you, look, the messy part. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys have a great day. And if you have any suggestions on what I should make in the future, let me know. Take care. Bye.